Hi, welcome back, Pei here, with a quick update. Gojira's Joe Duplantier has officially joined the ESP family. ESP recently confirmed this exciting news on their social media, revealing that they custom-crafted a special chrome-finished guitar for Joe's performance at the Olympics. This totally backs up what I guessed in my earlier video. Let me share the details. Quote from ESP's Instagram. ESP is honored to welcome Joe Duplantier, the rhythm guitarist, vocalist, and the lyricist of iconic metal band Gojira, to our roster of artists. You may have seen Joe at the opening ceremonies of the Paris Olympics, performing on a very special chrome-finished ESP XJ model that we custom-crafted for the occasion. We look forward to a great relationship with Joe as an ESP artist. Their official website also highlighted Joe's Olympic performance, noting the global viewership of over 1 billion people. They reiterated, We're honored to have Joe as part of our artist family and look forward to a great relationship with him as an ESP artist. More details about Joe and his choice of ESP will be available soon. I'm personally stoked about the potential release of a chrome-finished XJ signature model. While the Japanese custom shop version is likely to be quite expensive, I'm hoping they'll also produce more accessible models, like an E2 or an LTD version, so more fans can get their hands on one. Interestingly, Chevelle's website still lists Joe's signature guitar for sale, which means we still don't know whether this is a full switch to ESP or dual endorsement. Typically, when a guitarist switches endorsements, the previous signature models are quickly pulled from the market. For example, when Dave Mustaine moved to Gibson, Dean Guitars swiftly removed his signature models, and the same happened when Mick Thompson switched to ESP. Given this context, a dual endorsement seems likely. What do you think? Will Joe fully switch to ESP or keep dual endorsements? Drop your thoughts in the comments. I love reading what you all have to say. Your comments are always so insightful and humorous. For instance, shout out to Not Gary Brown, who perfectly captured the essence of Joe's choice with this comment. Frenchman, I'll take the one that looks like it cuts off aristocrats heads, please. Exactly. You nailed it. Joe's chrome finished guitar definitely gives off that guillotine vibe, fitting perfectly with the performance. Looks like I spent 8 minutes overthinking, while well, Joe just went straight for the revolutionary option. Clever observation. Alright, if you enjoyed this update, give it a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed, so that you never miss a video. Thanks for watching, stay heavy, and catch you in the next one.